Okay, here we go. We're gonna leave dry land. And we are gonna head out to the high seas to talk about our award-winning Disney Cruise Line. Our, our, our majestic new ship, the Disney Wish, took her maiden voyage in July. Oh, she's beautiful and is already a huge hit with our guests. And now we're gonna build on that momentum, turning our attention to the next entry into our fleet. For our sixth ship, we're dreaming up a brand new design concept that feels unlike anything Disney Cruise Line has ever done before. The, th the theme of the ship is adventure. <laughs> Celebrating, you knew it. <laughs> Celebrating Walt's lifelong love for exploration. This is gonna be an epic journey into Disney stories. And today, you're the first to see what the inside of this amazing new ship will look like. Here we go. <laughs> Looking good, huh? That grand hall is inspired by the grandeur and mystery of a gilded palace. It draws on real world influences from Asia and from Africa, as well as the far off land of Agrabah. As you see there, for the first time aboard one of our ships, the signature grand hall statue will feature three of our favorite characters, Jasmine, Aladdin, and their lovable magic carpet soaring together towards a whole new world of adventure. But wait here, there's a little detail. Do you all want to know the name of the ship? Yeah. Let's take a look. treasure and we can't wait for you to create memories aboard this spectacular new ship. Our growing fleet also allows us to go places that we've never been before. Because for our next adventure, I'm pleased to announce today that we will take the Disney Wonder to Australia and New Zealand. We will offer our first sailings in this part of the world beginning in late October of next year. The ship here is the destination on these voyages, inviting guests from this region into stories from Disney, Pixar, from Marvel, and Star Wars. And we're so glad to bring something new to those that may never have experienced this type of Disney magic before. Now, obviously then, I'm also excited to share that the Disney Wonders repositioning cruises will be our first South Pacific voyages giving you the chance to experience destinations like Fiji and Samoa, pretty cool. And there's more, and there is more. Our Disney Cruise Line has started work on our new island destination in the Bahamas. I told you I had a cool job. I had a chance to visit recently and I wanted you all to be the first to see it. Welcome to Lighthouse Point on the beautiful island of Eleuthera. We're still in the early stages, but I can tell this is going to be a spectacular location for our Disney Cruise Line guests. We have a long way to go, but just imagine the possibilities. That it's gonna keep going. That was the first time that I was on the island and I can tell you now from a personal uh, point of view that Lighthouse Point is going to be absolutely stunning. It's inspired by the stories of the Bahamas and we are committed to preserving and protecting the natural environment throughout this project. Get this everybody, 90% of the power used at Lighthouse Point will come from solar energy, 90% of the power. 
And we're working with local advisors and artists to create a destination that represents the natural beauty and the rich culture of the Bahamas. We want this to be an authentic experience filled with all kinds of Disney magic. Here is a brand new concept rendering that I'm sharing with you all for the first time uh, today. This is a, it's a great overview of what your day on Lighthouse Point will feel like. In addition, obviously, obviously to that gorgeous beach that you just saw a moment ago, you'll have a recreation center, you're gonna have food and merchandise locations, a youth activity area, and so much more. Uh, here's another uh, rendering showing a closer look at one of the island's pavilions. Uh, here, you know, guests will be able to immerse themselves much more deeply into the Bahamian culture. Uh, we're excited to create a place where you can learn about the stories and the traditions that are passed down by generations of Eleuthera's residents. Uh, we know how much our guests love Castaway Key, so we can't wait for you also to put your toes in the sand on this new island destination. So more to come there.